Okay, so, hello, hi, this is where the journey begins. How exciting. Uh, okay. The right choice for players who just want to sit back and enjoy. Nah, I ain't a little wuss. I mean, I am, but, you know. Uh, enemies are totally to be on. Primarily only enemies at a higher level will prove a challenge hard. Do I just go hard straight up? I think I will. Combat will be a substantial challenge. The effective use of perks, cyberware, combat gadgets, and consumables will be essential to survival. Uh, I think I'm just going to go normal to start with. And if I'm crushing dudes, we'll pick it up. All right, we'll pick it up. Uh, also, apologies if I look off to the side at all. I've got my little setup over here. I don't know how streamer men work, streamer men and women work, okay? But we're doing what we've got. Uh, I'm going to go normal, okay? And, yeah, like I said, if we crush some dudes, we'll pick it up. Uh, have any of you, have either of you guys played this before? Because I have not. Um, so any little tips and things will be appreciated. Now, I think this is the big choice here. Nomad, you start out in some wildland type areas. That'll be cool. Um, but I don't know if I'm super interested in that. It doesn't, uh, although there is a voice actor in this who I follow just as like an Australian, uh, personality, I guess. And she is a voice actor in that. So it'd be cool to find her as a character, but... I don't think it's worth it. Street Kid could be good. I like kind of starting from the bottom. And now we're here type thing, you know. Uh, but also Corpo is kind of what I'm leaning towards, I think. Uh, few leave the corporate world with their lives. Few are still with their souls intact. That's, I mean, that's very sort of demonic-ish sounding there. But, you know, I like I like the idea behind already being in it and, and just going for it. Okay, so that's my plan. Um, I am torn between Street Kid though. Okay, Street Kid, Corpo. Oh, do I want to just jump right in and be a corporate man? A little corporate guy. Um, down here, the Lord of Jungle dictates the weak. Serve the strong. The only one I see you've yet to break. No, I think I'm going to be a corporate. Alright, we've decided. Okay. Oh, they've made her look a bit different. These appearance may sometimes affect the behavior of other characters. Well, I'm not going to go too crazy with uh, my look. Okay, now we're on to the body types, though. I'm obviously I'm going to go the male, just because I'm a male as well. And so it's a little bit easier to connect with, you know? That's what I'm feeling. Uh, although that... It doesn't to me that doesn't represent female that represents more of like a robotic look she looks like she's got some stuff done um, but over here voice tone MV. okay that was a female and that is not uh, what MV. I'm after I'm V I'm V I'm I'm V okay we're gonna go with the male I'm V skin tone now I'm rather white but does that mean I'm also going to make my V rather white? Probably. Yeah, probably. Okay. Um, okay, that's... You know, I when I'm creating a, a character, I like to kind of not base them around myself, but, yeah, just kind of make them look the way that I look. But, you know, to a reasonable extent. Um... So am I going to make this a white blonde guy with blue eyes? Yeah. Yeah, I am. Skin type. Oh, okay. I've heard that there's a lot of customization for this. Um, you, have, you said you haven't played it yet? Uh, Xbox Series X? I'm telling you, man. PlayStation all the way. I mean, I don't really care. I would get, it, I would get an Xbox if they had good games, but they just don't, you know? Um, although it does look like they're getting some soon, so pff, I don't know what I'm going to do. I might have to chuck some cash out. Okay, hairstyle. This is what I came for. I love having a good hairstyle. Rotate. Okay, that doesn't look good. 
Should I change my hair color first so that it's like a good... Yeah, I think we'll go with the blonde if I can find any blonde hair. And then I'll change the style. Okay, so this style is not what I'm going for. Alright, so chill out. Um, oh, that looks okay. Looks okay. Is there any just like traditional hair colors? Um, what do you, I don't know, this is hard. God, there's so much to choose from, you know? Okay, I think that's, I think that's the full rotation of hair colors. There wasn't really any that I, see that one maybe, maybe that one, but that looks quite yellow. I'm not, I'm not that yellow, you know, possibly this one. And I'm assuming you can change this like at any point later on. That one looks alright, but that's a bit dark for me, you know? Um, I think I'm just going to go with that for now. Okay, and we'll pick the hairstyle from here. Oh, jeez, okay. The mohawk, all the way down. See, that's very sort of trendy, isn't it? Is this all we get? Oh, no, I just went in reverse. Sorry, I pressed the back button, so I thought we were seeing the same styles. Okay. Um... Do I want something that's, like, similar? I don't want to get blue hair, Ben, okay? This is going to represent me and my character, all right? It's going to stay true to form, and I'm kind of liking this. If it wasn't, like, trimmed up the back here, but, you know, I'm not totally against it. I I'm down for a long hair option. That's very slick and suave, this one. Uh, no, that's, that's like David Bowie sort of ness. Um, eh. Oh, that's 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 a bit, that's a bit too slick, I think, for me. No, that, not not keen on that. It's going to be quite wild. Most of these options, I'm assuming, right? Has to be. Um, well, that's a bit boring, isn't it? Okay, we're liking the man bun. Uh, let's try... No. So there's what? Almost 40 hairstyles to choose from? That's not a bad selection. That's not a bad selection. Um, you know, I think most of this uh, episode is going to be just... Or most of this stream, rather, is going to be just me customizing this guy. But am I, like, against that? No. I'm not. Okay. Oh, all right. That's that's. Mm, I'm not. I keen. I'm not keen on that man bun. It's like wavy hair and too high. You know, back in the day, this I would have picked this. This one, little sort of wavy locks. So far, I'm liking that uh, man bun look. Oh, but this though, kind of surfer boy. It's kind of you know bringing the mane in. Not against it. I'm not against it. Don't know if it beats the man bun, though. You know, oh, jeez. Yeah, not a fan. Um, that's way too emo for me, sorry. Oh, a balding spot, nice. Um, oh, I, I kind of like this for you, Benny. I reckon that would be perfect. Should I call you Ben or Spoon Man? I'll call you Spoon Man, okay? Even though that's not your actual name on here either, but... Uh, okay, now we're back to the start of where we were. I think, I think it's gonna be man bun. I think that's what has been the winner so far. Look, I'm liking this. Although, I hate that. I hate how it's wide on his head. Do you see that? Like, it makes, it makes him look like he has a huge brain. Do you know what I mean? So maybe go something a bit more slick boy, like this, like you were mentioning. Yeah, the slick boy. Number nine, okay. Number, I think so far it's number nine over the man bun. See, that's too slick for me. I don't want that. I This is a little bit more loose, but also slick. So it's this or long wavy boy from the start. Not the start, sorry. Um, I'll try find it. This one. It's either this or number nine. 
I think that's what we're going to go with. This or number nine. So, mm, I think I'm going to go with a slick boy. Yeah, we're going to go with a slick boy. Yep, slick boy it is. I like it. I like the decision that we've made, and we can always change it. Um, let's have a double check of the hair colors just to see. Yeah, no, I think we got the right one. Okay, eyes. Oh, very robotic like, aren't they? Um, well, what's changing here? Is it the shape of the eye or is it the eye color? Okay, let's do this again. We'll go with color first. Is that considered blue? These are a bit bloodshot, these eyes. I don't want bloodshot eyes. Um, that's blue. Sorry, seeing a cat's tail. Yeah, she's in here trying to jump all over me. I like that. It's a nice little blue. Um, there's also... Oh, okay. Um, I don't want any of the crazy stuff. I want a real eye, but I'm kind of down... Oh, I don't... Cat's eye. If I Do I want to go Witcher style? I could. I don't think I want that. I think I'm going to go with... It's either that one or that one. I think I'm going to go a little bit darker blue, because I'm a little bit darker blue, you know? You can't see at all on this camera, but if you were to see me in person, I'm going to go with that. Okay, now we can change the actual eye type. God, there's a lot, isn't there? You know, with eyes and things, I tend to just go with the default, because it's a bit, like, too hard to really choose something that's decent. I think number one is fine. You know, number one's fine. Eyebrows. Hmm. Again, you should do the eyebrow color. See, that's my tip for when you're creating a character at all, is always do the color first. Now, my eyebrows are a little bit darker than my actual hair. Keep note of that. So, we'll go... Oh, I like quite like number two there. I think that's similar to my eyebrows. Jack Nicholson eyebrows, no thanks. Yeah, we're going to go number two. Wow, look how high we are on the bar of <laughs> uh, creating stuff at the moment. Uh, we've got a lot to do here. Strap yourself in. Okay. Strap yourself in. Alright. Mouth, nose, eyes and ears and mouth and nose, heads, shoulders, knees and toes. Uh, we'll probably get to heads, shoulders, knees and toes, won't we? 21 noses. I don't even know if I know that many people with different noses. Again kind of a similar thing. I think we're just going to go your sort of standard. Now, my actual nose, like me personally, my real nose, kind of has like a little uptick at the end, you know, a little bit, a little bit like that. So do I go with that or do I just go your traditional old fashioned stock standard nose? I'm kind of like a number seven. Let's check number seven against number one. I like number seven. Yeah. Number seven for me it is. Mouth. Let's start on number 14. Very good mouth. I've got kind of big lips. So, could be number 13. You know? Um, oh, I, I kind of like number nine, but it's a little bit, you know, sort of twisted and turned. Oh, I like, I like number six. Six is good. Mm, that's a bit big for me, I think. Uh, 
We started on what, 14? I think I'm, hmm, 13 or 6? Six. 6. Let's go with number 6. Okay, I'm happy with it. Jaw, God. This guy better look good at the end, you know? Oof, jeez. How many jaws are there? Probably a few, I would imagine, right? Okay, it's 21. So it looks like there's 21 of most of these things. Um, I've already forgotten what one we started on. Um, I don't think it was that. I think it was probably that. And I'm happy with that. I think we're just going to keep that. Um, ears. I do have ears as well. Um, okay, ear time. I think number one is I'm happy with already, you know? Like, I mean, what's what's an ear going to do for me? Number four? That's a nice looking ear. That's a, that's a nice looking ear. Oh, it sticks out a little bit. Yeah, no. Look, I'm just going to go number one. I don't care. Beard. I'm a beard man. Even though I personally don't have one, I do like beards. Okay, or oh, hang on. Beard colour, first things first. We want a similar colour to how I've got my eyebrows. I think that is better rather than that. Because that's that's not what my hair colour is. Okay, so we're gonna go with that and now we'll pick our beard again. Some nice that's that could be nice, you know. It's a it's a good looking beard. Pretty standard. It's a bit handlebarish. I don't know if that's for me. Now, I do like this as well. A bit, a bit thick around the goatee, you know. Still a little bit on the sides. Oh, samurai time. Samurai, that could fit into the game. Maybe that's what we do. Um, that's a bit big for me. That one, that's not bad either. You know, that's not bad. We could go with that. Uh, that's very sort of, uh, you know, make your jaw look big. Hmm. No. No, not off. I, I think I do want a beard. Now, number three is nice. I, I'm, I'm seriously considering number three. Giving that a good look over. What was the other one that I liked? This one. I think number three is going to be our go. Or is it number eight? No, it's number three. Yeah, it's number three. Oh, and then we can do this. Oh, okay. Not bad. It's changing some of the lengths all over the place. Okay. What if I go now to number... Uh, what was it? This one. How does that change this? Hmm, yeah, no. Number three. And we'll just leave that. Done the beard colour already. Cyberware. Now, this is where we get into the good stuff, isn't it? Um, alright. Oof. So, like, fully integrated eye sockets. Um, that's a bit much. I don't think I want a lot. But, like, enough to where I am still cyber person. You know? New throat. That's a bit smokerish, isn't it? And I don't smoke. You know, we might just stick with the standard number seven. Yeah, look, I think it's a safe bet. Big brain plays, you know, it's up here. We've worked on the, we've worked on the brain, so that's what we're going to go with. I don't want any scars. I'm untouched. Untouched. I don't want any facial tattoos. I don't think I want any piercings either. But I could be down... You know, I'm very boring in this char character creator, probably. There's probably a lot of people who want, like, real crazy stuff. And in a cyberpunk world, I understand. I understand that. Fully. But, this is what we're going with. My idea. My creation. Also... Uh, no, I'll get to that a bit later, actually. Um, look, I'm happy with the... Mm, one stud? 
one stud. I think we could go with one stud. Let's see. Yeah, we'll have one stud in, that's fine. But it's got to be silverish white. Yeah, okay, teeth. Okay, happy to go with the zero teeth, standard. Essentially just its colour. Um, I'm happy with, with what we've got there. Eye makeup. He does have eye makeup on. I thought he did. I don't want eye makeup. Okay? I'm in the corporate world. Do you think they're going to allow eye makeup? No. I, I don't want any lip makeup either. That's quite tribal, that one, isn't it? Same with that, I guess. If I was making a female, these would be... I don't even know if they'd be good options there. Hmm. I didn't see any. Oh, I think it's just adding freckles. I'm good. Uh, I don't need any of this. Um, I can do my fingernails. Alright. Alright, I guess we're doing fingernails too. What's even changing? Oh, it's the length. That's all I'm looking at. Um, well, I don't want long. That's a bit rough. What are my nail colours? Quite, quite pink. Yeah, I mean, standard. Alright, we're under the nipples. You can turn your nipples off. Wow. Wow. What a, what a character customization option we have here. Body tattoos. Oof. Oof. Jeez. I don't think I want any tattoos. I'm playing Assassin's Creed at the moment, and I'm getting tattoos in that. So if that's where you want to see tattoos, if you want to see tattoos, that's the place to go. Okay, that's tattoo content for sure. Um, I don't want body scars. I'm untouched, like I said. Okay. Can I blank this out? <laughs> uh, look, we'll just get through it, okay? Um, oh, okay, it's the two versions for a man and the standard for... Okay, well, I'm going to go with that one. And, and look, we're going to stick to traditional. I don't know why I'm checking all of these options, but here we are. Um, okay. What else can we check? Is that it? Are we done? I have to go square. I know, right? You walked in at the exact right moment. I Trust me, I've been here the whole time. Do you want me to go through it again for you? Just so you didn't miss anything for sure. So, we had to decide what type of man I am. Okay, alright, I'll, I'll, I'll go across. Uh, alright, I wonder if it's going to, like, cover me back up. Because it hasn't yet. Uh, Alright, what's this? Body determines your raw physical power. God, that's quite aggressive, isn't it? In addition to allowing you to force open doors, each level of body will add 5 health points and 3 stamina points. Increase damage with fists and gorilla arms. Gorilla arms? Man, it's like really, really strong. Increase damage of melee weapons, decrease movement penalty while grabbing an enemy, increase movement while grappling. Okay, body could be good. Oh, so this is like the real sort of, uh, um, what's it called? Like RPG character creation stuff? I don't think that's it. You know, like in Dungeons and Dragons where you get, um, you know, you, you, have, you have like charisma and intelligence. I feel like that this is their version of that. Am I right in that? I think so. Yeah, yeah, Fallout, they do the same thing. Um, I think it's just RPG elements of the of the game itself. Um, 
intelligence determines your net running proficiency. From what I understand, net running is like your hacking ability and how well you can hack into, um, well, I guess anything really. This whole game is about hacking. Um, yeah, special. S P E C I A L. Uh, reflexes. Reflexes determine your maneuverability in addition to increasing your overall movement speed. Uh, each level... In, oh, see, I like movement speed, so reflexes might be the one for me. Increase your evasion, uh, crit chance, and damage from mantis blades. I've heard... I've seen a lot of gameplay footage with the mantis blades. So maybe you just start with them. Technical ability represents your technical know-how. allows you unlock doors and use tech weapons. Could be could be good. Uh, cool. Cool determines your resilience. Really? Composure and effectiveness in operating from stealth. I think cool could be the one for me as well. Increase stealth damage. Reduce the speed at which enemies detect you. Hold on, give me two seconds. I'm back. Um, okay, I think... I think cool and reflexes but I like to be intelligent too uh, so the way that I want to play the game is by uh, I don't like run in and kill everyone you know I want to I want to play it cool and uh, I like to talk people out of stuff you know that that sort of thing um, I think we're gonna go down what's the max six six is the max okay what if I go to there I go to there. Mm, intelligence. Increase cyber deck RAM capacity. Uh, what are we thinking here? I like reflexes because it makes you fast. And I like being fast. Even though I'm like not going to fight anyone. I'm just going to talk to people. Is there going to be like a another character zone section where you get to pick that type of thing? I don't know. I don't know. Technical ability represents your technical know-how. This is tough, man. This is tough. I always get stuck on this type of thing. Um, but see, this is going to increase my armor. But again, I don't really want to be in a situation where I need to use my armor. You know? I want to just be um, kind of What's it called? I don't know. Um, I'm blanking on the word. I just want to like maneuver around situations. I think I'm going to go down here. I'll go up in the body too, so I can have more health. Intelligence at four, reflexes at five, technical ability. Jeez, I don't know. Intelligence. Look, I think I think technical ability. We go up one. Yeah, so three is the minimum, okay, six is the maximum. I'm happy with having three really close to full, I think. I think that's what we've decided on, well, what I've decided on. And, hmm, I guess I haven't made any progress in the game, so if I want to just come back, like, we can, you know? Um, alright, moving on. Do I not get to change, like, how ripped I am? I want to just be super jacked. <laughs> not super jacked. Like, very athletic look type, you know? Um, letting my cat in. In you come. Come on. Yes, hello. Ugh. Yeah, your name is V. Well, I think... I thought you could hear the cat. That's hilarious. She yells at me all the time. It is insane. Um, okay, so the V aspect, right? I think in most games these days, they just pick, like, something standard uh, you can use uh, it, with a voice. Like, so if, your na if my name is Liam, right, I can't have my character be called Liam because 
they're not going to voice act every name that exists, you know, because that's going to take forever. So they they set something like V, and it's easy for them to voice act. That's kind of how I un I understand it working. I'm just going to go back for a second. I just want to make sure I haven't missed anything in here, like uh, body type. I thought there'd be a body type option. Um, okay, no, it just goes straight to that stuff. We'll get off that screen. Um, I think we're good. I think we're good. Are we good? I'm pretty sure we are. Okay, alias V, Corpo. Few leave the corporate, corporate world with their lives. Few are still with their souls intact. You've been there. You've bent the rules, exploited secrets, and weaponized information. There's no such thing as a fair game. Only winners and losers. I'm ready to jump in. You know, I think we're good to go. Send it, my boy. That's it. We're doing it. Confirming. Look at this. I'm very keen. I've been waiting three months to play this game. Well, it's probably closer to two, but also like several years in the making as well. Hopefully it works. Like, there's supposed to be heaps of bugs in this game, but... And I'm playing it on PS5, so... We'll see, I guess. We'll see how we go. Um, but I'm just going to go for it. Actually, right here, that's me for the first episode, at least. I'm not ending the stream, but uh, that is, for YouTube viewers, going to be my first episode, okay? There will be plenty more of this to come. Hopefully, I've figured out how to cut this and upload it properly and not lose my footage because that has been a trend if you've seen my other videos so uh youtube stuff we're gonna call it here that's my character creation tune in next time for all the other good stuff where we actually play the game because we didn't do that yet